Alright guys, just making a quick video today talking about this questing add-on that like nobody uses, yet it is infinitely better than Questy and is in my humble opinion the best questing add-on that you can download. I've been using this add-on since the very early days of the first Nestarius vanilla World of Warcraft server. It was originally designed for vanilla World of Warcraft servers actually, but the databases have been updated for TBC and Wrath of the Lich King and I've had hundreds of people on my streams ask me what on earth is this add-on that I'm using and the add-on is called Codex Lite. It used to be called PF Quest and then before that it was actually called Shagu Quest. Now the reason why it's better than Questy is well first of all it actually works. I don't know about you guys but ever since I've been leveling a Wrath Lich King with Questy it's been absolutely terrible. The only reason why I was using Questy not Classic Codex is because Classic Codex wasn't up to date in time for the Wrath Lich King launch. But now obviously it is up to date for Wrath Lich King, hence why I'm making a video about it. But my experience with Questy was really, really bad. It was giving me very severe FPS drops, intermittent lag spikes, and just like really weird jittery gameplay. And it would nearly crash my game whenever I opened the map, very slowly loading all of the quest locations and quest items that I have to get on the map. It's been a very bad user experience for me personally using Questy, and it always just seems to be out of date. You like, download it one day, you update it, and the next day it's out of date and it's not working again. And I have started leveling my Warlock now, and finally I am able to use Codex Lite, and it is just... It's just a godsend. It's like as smooth as butter. It's working perfectly. Let me show you why Codex Lite is better. So as you can see, we've got locations on the map where I need to kill enemies. One more druid here, which I haven't leveled for like probably like six months. And as you can see, it has very pristine and clean spawn locations. Now Questy, if we go and enable Questy, I can show it on the map here. Look how inaccurate Questy is. Okay, just look at it. Like It's showing like the general area and the populace of these mobs, but it isn't showing actual spawn locations directly from Wowhead. It is just so much easier to find mobs or to find quest items on the ground using Codex Lite. And if you're struggling like to see things, as you can see, you can just click this to change the color to make the color stand out a little bit. So, you know, green stands out a little bit next to this blue, there you go. So this is two different quests and I can see them more clearly now. I mean, this is just so much better than this. I mean, look, like it has one, two, three, four, five daggers along this beach. I'm pretty sure there's more than five different spawn locations for these blood mist hatchlings. And as you can see, Codex Light is showing me all of them, where they all are. And I'll go here and get my quest done way faster because I can see exactly where they are. And, you know, when there is competition for mobs, it will tell you where mobs do actually spawn. So when you have to camp a particular boss or a named enemy for a particular quest, or just any mob, to be honest, you can camp the spawn location. I use this so much on classic WoW launches because obviously there's loads of competition to defeat named enemies, but I could camp the spawn location and it was just so much easier to find where the mobs are going to spawn. But obviously, nab that mob tag and get your quest completed before anyone else. Best combo, in my opinion, also is to get Liatrix maps and Liatrix plus when it comes to leveling. This is the reason why I'm able to like zoom in properly on my minimap and hold and click and drag it around. I can see, you know, spawn locations even more precisely with this zoom in feature. It's much, much better than just having Questy with the default map. And the reason why I recommend getting Liatrix plus is because of this enhanced quest log feature. So first of all, this is going to make the quest log much wider, much easier to read. You don't really need to scroll as much to get all the information of a quest, and you can just generally see your quest log way better and just keep better track of all of your quests. And if you obviously do need to read quest information, it does happen from time to time. You can't just rely on a questing add-on the whole time because you can just jump to a location and be like, what on earth do I do here? Do I have an item in my bag or do I do this? Do I need to bring an NPC with me from where I got the quest, yada yada. And another great feature of Liatrix Plus is you can show Wowhead links on the quest log. So as you can see here, I've got a little Wowhead over there. I can control C and just paste that into my browser. If I need to get any more information on this quest, you know, I'm struggling with a certain quest, don't really understand what's going on. Type it in, read some Wowhead comments to get some clarity and just get on with it.
So I'm going to end the video there, just a quick one today guys as I'm working on other projects which will be coming very soon. If you want more good add-ons and also really good week horrors and macros, I recommend subscribing to the channel, checking out my subscriber only trailer because I've got a huge behemoth guide for literally every single class in the game when it comes to that kind of thing, it's just in the description so check that out. Anyway, my name is Metagoblin, to the next video, ciao.